Hey guys, so this is like my sixth time trying to upload this video. And <laughs> hopefully six times is a charm. Um, but if you guys have a Walmart that's out by you, all of this paper that I'm about to show you is one dollar for the paper pads. And this is regular five dollars at Walmart. Um, this is a 30 page stack of texture cardstock. These are the colors right here. And it's by color book, and this was one dollar. This is white um, texture cardstock, 40 in a pack, $1. All of these are a dollar, but um, this one right here I use with my Cameo, and it works really, really well um, for 3D projects. So if you guys have a Walmart out by you and your stuff is going clearance, then you need to check this out because these are all one buck. <clears throat> And then I have this one. This is, um, and I have it upside down so that I can share with you guys the prints. But this is paper, but it works really good with like multimedia with men's cards. I mean, it's really, really nice paper. And um, again, this was a dollar. Just wanted to share with you guys the patterns. Beautiful patterns in here. Look at that clock. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful pattern. Look, look at that. It looks like wallpaper. Especially this one looks like wallpaper. So that was a dollar. This textured um, cardstock is called Spring Pastels. It's a little different from the other one that I share, share with you. This has 30 sheets in it. And then last but not least, there's this one that is a glitter cardstock. Beautiful glitter paper. And it's not the glitter that comes off like in your hand. It's like embedded in the paper. And this one was also $1. There's only 10 sheets in here, but I mean, for 10 cents a sheet, you can't beat it. So that, that I got from Walmart today. So if you guys get a chance, please go over to your Walmart and check them out. This stuff I got from a cherry on top. This is from Kate and Company, some washi tape. And you guys know me, I love blue. And um, this is like a navy blue and white polka dot washi. So that's really cute. I love that. Um, this one is by Kate and Company, My Mind's Eye. I loved it for the glasses. This is a little stamp set that you can use for journaling and stuff like that. This is a Dear Lizzie. You guys have seen this before because it's sort of old. But I just love this little jar. I have a jar stamp that's larger than this. But I just love the way that they made this particular jar. So really cute. This is a Dear Lizzie in American Crafts. I loved it because of this font and because of this saying, Find You, Be You. I love that saying. And then down here it says, The best thing in life is love. And of course, I had to get it because of this little teacup over here. Really, really cute. Then um, I bought the Lucky Charm um, paper pad. Um, because I bought some of the individual papers before archives went out of business, but I never bought the entire pack. So this has the thickers in there and um, 18 sheets of the 12 by 12 paper. Beautiful. I love this one with the little hearts and, you know. And then this one, um, I, I could only find the 6 by 6 pad at Archiver, so I bought the 12 by 12 from a cherry on top. And this is Find Your Wings and Fly. And this is the... Uh, 12 by 12. I shared with you guys the 6 by 6 already. And then um, I want the romance novel paper pad, but of course I cannot find it. And the reason why I want it is because Aisha O had been talking about it. And I was like, well, let me go and check out what this romance novel paper is all about. And of course it is absolutely gorgeous. So I was able to find a few 12 by 12 sheets. I found this one which you guys have probably already seen before. And the reason why I really like it is because you can actually cut these out and these become little envelopes. And these are like little tabs. Very, very cute. So if anybody knows where I can find the romance novel, like A2 A, A or whatever, whatever the sizes are, I don't know. But I want the paper pad itself and it's very hard to find. So I'm looking for that. But look at this, guys. Very, very cute paper. And then this is the back side of that paper. Very cute. Um, I got this one. I, I didn't realize I had two sheets of this, but this is so cute. I could see this as a layout in this stuff. I wouldn't even cut this. Just put your pictures and stuff on there and decorate it. Oh, that's the reason why I got two. It's because of this cutout on the back. I love cutouts, so I'm going to definitely be fussy cutting that out. And that was my other one that I bought. And then I bought, of course, another one of these sheets because I want to make some more of those journals. 
and I thought this was so cute. I love the pattern. And I just really like this Dear Lizzie paper. So I bought it. It look, looks like little clipboards that you can kind of fussy cut and put on your projects and stuff. And I love this little yellow polka dot and this blue stripe line over here. And then this is the back side of it right here. So that is about it, I think, guys. That is all that I needed to share with you guys. I finally got through this video. Um, but in any event, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And I will get back with you as soon as I possibly can. Take care. Bye.